once upon a time, there lived a very beautiful princess who was born deaf. She was loved by everyone because she is kind and loyal. She loves dancing. Her maids always dance for her on daily basis. The smiles on her face shows it all. A personal maid. Chica derives joy dancing for her. Chica was chosen for her because she was the best dancer in the community. Every morning, Chica will dance graciously for Princess Omar. Her parents loves her so much and her dad the king never allows her to walk alone in the village. He instructed her maids and bodyguards to go with her whenever she wants to go around the village. Even though she was deaf, her father never stopped talking about her and how beautiful she is. Ada, my beautiful daughter, he praised Princess Omar. On one faithful day, the princess sneaks out of the palace to see the nature, as she always do with her maids and guards. She was so happy that she was doing it alone this time. It feels so good here, seeing the beautiful creatures. It's so lovely here, Princess Oma thought in her mind. What a lovely place, she exclaimed. There in the forest is a hunter called Joan, who was hunting in the same bush the princess was. Joan was known to be a very good hunter. He never goes home empty-handed for once. Suddenly, Joan sighted a rabbit. He aimed at it and pulled the trigger. Unfortunately, the rabbit escaped and the bullet hits Princess Oma and she fell. He rushed to see what he has killed. On getting there, he saw it was Princess Oma. He was surprised and scared. He then ran away. He got to his house feeling restless, as his conscience couldn't allow him to rest. Joan was contemplating on whether to go report the issue or not. Then, he concluded that he will not report it or say a word to anyone because he could be killed by the king if he does. Never, I will never say a word to anyone, he said in his mind. As he was battling with his thoughts, his friend Jeff rushed in and told him if he has held about what is going on in the village. He replied and said no. What is going on? Then Jeff went ahead and said to Jan, Do you know that the king's daughter, Princess, almost found dead in the bush today? Someone found her lifeless body and came to report to the king. As I speak to you now, nobody knows where the killer is hiding. Jan replied and said, But Princess Oma is a very peaceful young lady who could have done this to her. Them, it's heartbreaking, Jeff continued, but the king is happy to know that someone killed the daughter of. He said that she was always disgracing them since she was born deaf, that he will like to reward Wover that has helped him to end his shame by killing his daughter Princess Omar. As it stands now, it seems someone said he was the one that killed her, but I'm not very sure. Jan surprisingly said, are you serious? He? I was the one that killed her. He rushed and ran to the palace as he got there. He knelt before the king and then narrated how the whole thing happened, unknowingly to the villagers. The king has planned to court up with the killer of her daughter, since nobody has agreed to know or see who killed Princess Oma his daughter. The king, who was angry and sad for the death of her daughter, ordered his guards immediately to take John away. Oh, 